they're not going to be shocked coming into the Cole Center. Stevie Jordan trying to initiate, goes right around a lean forward, and the Bronx take an early lead. Some of defending right there by Tyler Wall as he got tripped up by Ryder. Trice had his pocket picked by Jordan. He's so good at that. Trice. And now Pritzel for three. Finally for the Badgers. And Reavers with a high degree of difficulty couldn't get it to go over the top of Ogie Muno Johnson. Jordan driving and Stevie Jordan. So let's see how many of those options now Wisconsin uses as Ryder's been in zone a good amount of the time so far tonight. Pritzel, second three ball, and he's two for two. That also helps beating the zone, his outside shooting. And it's so much better, as you mentioned, in the conference overall. You saw the note about 12 of the six of the 16 teams in the net rankings, 12 of them coming from this conference. And you know there's no uh, shortage of confidence there. That's one thing that they were talking about, shoot arounds and even before the game. This is a team that does not lack confidence as Reavers gets the roll. It was ACL after eight games last year in the first game of conference play in Iowa. Worked his tail off, and another block by Reavers coming over from the weak side. Little things that Wisconsin has really held their hat on in this program's history. Aline four deep three. Gordon picking up his second personal foul. It's one of your leading scorers, top defender on the floor, too. Aline Ford back on the floor. Just over a minute to go in this first half. Halftime show coming up. As Brevin Pritzel, tough shot, chance for a three-point play. I like sitting next to smart people. It makes me feel like I'm smart. I feel smarter just being in their presence as Brad Davison knocks down a three to open it up. Great defense tries, however, couldn't finish. He is 0 for 5 from the floor. Jordan trying to press the tempo, and Jordan lays it up and in. Well, you got to be about the next play. Price off to a slow start. Davison is two for two to open up the second half. So many times fans want to worry about how many points a guy scores, but we got to look next level and see what else are they doing to help their team win. Nunez for a three. Not a guy you can leave open. And he makes 31% of them. Davison, can he go three for three? Absolutely. So just to finish that thought, is Reavers running the floor. Slam it down, big fella! That's when you put on your big boy shoes. It's conference play. Well, and you know, any win in Big Ten play is a good one. Great feed underneath from Trice to Reavers again with a dunk. In years past, you could look at a schedule and say, all right, I, I think we can get a win there. We should get a win there. Reavers is four straight to make it a 40-21 ball game. Yeah, I'm not comfortable saying that. No, that's a go-ahead, that's a must-win, or that, or that is a win. Yeah. Like, it's not. It's just this conference and what they do and how good it is. Still 34th and 35th in Ken Palm. I mean, it's because of the way they've scheduled. Trice for three. Two for his last two. He's got to get hot in the second half. And, you know, I, I know a lot of people are out there are, you know, looking at it and saying, oh, this, you know, 48-21. And Brian, yeah, you played at Wisconsin. You see Walt McGlory on the floor for the first time tonight. Potter, with Ford, and Trice, and Pritzel. Potter, nice move underneath. Potter, who's got three rebounds now with a couple of points, a couple of blocks. What that move? He might be on the dance floor on New Year's Eve with that kind of footwork. Caleb Wesson is a huge load for Ohio State. Who? Yeah, the guy, right? I mean, when you look at what Ohio State has, Caleb Wesson, there's so many other players there, but Caleb Wesson might be the best big in the Big Ten. Wisconsin playing good basketball at the right time. Underneath, Ford got his man up in the air. Even up as much as they are, Wisconsin is cutting with a better pace, and every cut has a meaning. It's really good basketball. And there's a backdoor cut and a finish. And how they've opened this thing up in this second half. And it's a great sign of things to come for the Badgers, too. As Davison steps back and he continues his great second half. Those are two of their more signature victories, as well as Tennessee. Nice move by Williams to get around the corner. It's the end. Big Show delivers highlights, post-game interviews, expert analysis, all the news and notes from around the conference. Don't miss it. It's coming up in just a couple of moments. A great win today on New Year's Eve for Wisconsin, Brian.